If you are looking for a quick and easy solution to add trains to Unreal Engine, then you've come to the right place. The Train Controller Asset is a powerful complete and user-friendly railroad building system, designed to make it easier to create custom railroads and add functional trains to your game in minutes. The Train Controller Asset Collection is available on the Unreal Marketplace, links in the description below. Let's start by dropping a railroad into the level. I'll also disable mesh generation temporarily, so I can edit the rails without wasting resources regenerating the rails after every single small change. I will use the top view, as it allows a better view of the railroad shape. The railroad editor allows me to manipulate the railroad really fast, as you can see, with a few button clicks, I'm able to create perfectly precise curves. It is also possible to edit the railroad manually, by using the Unreal Editor default spline editing tools. I'm satisfied with the results, so I'll re-enable mesh generation, to apply the changes to the railroad. For this demonstration, I intend on having two trains running in opposite directions, so I will use the create parallel spline operation, to duplicate the rails, as you can see, all it takes is a single button click. This is only one of the many editing tools available in the asset, all of which were designed to make the editing process as easy and user-friendly as possible. I'll cover the other tools in the next tutorial, for now, let's open the route manager, and define some routes, for the rails we've just created. This step is necessary, to make it easier to spawn trains, and or adjust the railcar's initial positions later. Adding trains to the level is really easy, you just need to select a train profile, a target route and click on spawn. I'll use the freight train for this demonstration, but keep in mind that all types of trains are supported. You can also create your own custom train profiles. By the way, everything is customizable. The rails, locomotives, wagons, railroad props, everything. I'll cover the customization features on another tutorial, for now, let's focus on the trains. Trains are possessed by the AI controller by default, but it is also possible for a player to possess a train and drive it like a vehicle. Randomization features are also available to make it easier to create train variations, the paint job color, railcar textures, freight wagons initial cargo state and the number of wagons that compose the train are all randomized on spawn. The footage you've just watched was left in real time on purpose. Two minutes was all it took, to create the rails and add functional trains to the level. That's how powerful and user-friendly the train controller asset is. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments section below. I would also love to know which features would you like to be included in the future updates. Don't forget to visit the Unreal Marketplace for a closer look on the train controller collection. It has everything you need to add trains to your Unreal Engine project, so what are you waiting for? I'll be waiting for you, in the next tutorial.